25 miles north of Charleston, South Carolina, the Santee River flows into the Atlantic Ocean. There, heading south, a hundred barrier islands, forming what's known as the Sea Island Chain. These barrier islands protect the coastlands of South Carolina, Georgia, and Florida. And by the time they reach Florida, only three major islands remain, Amelia Island, Big Talbot Island, and Little Talbot Island. When people talk about this 25 mile section of coastline, they commonly just lump it together and refer to it as Amelia Island. If you've not been to this section of Florida before, you may be surprised at how strikingly beautiful it is. And as Florida residents and beach enthusiasts, we highly recommend these beaches. Few places in Florida have such wide open spaces, such little traffic, and such a rich supply of seashells and shark's teeth for you to collect. Add to that the delightful seaside community of Fernandina Beach, and you have the perfect vacation location for family excursions and romantic getaways. Today, on the Best Life Adventure Channel, we visit Amelia Island. We started off our trip to Amelia Island with a bang by visiting the Marlin and Barrel Distillery to help them celebrate their eighth birthday. They opened the doors at 11 a.m. and immediately began offering free samples of all their products to those of us who came to help them celebrate. We toured the facility and then had an opportunity to visit with Roger, the founder and owner. I'm Roger Morris, the owner of Marlin and Barrel Distillery. And we're super excited because this weekend we're celebrating our eight year anniversary. Look us up, come see us. We're located right in historic Fernandina Beach on Amelia Island, which is also just a great place to come and, and visit. A quick five minute drive east of there, we visited the Amelia Island Lighthouse. If you're going to visit here, check their website first. Right now it's only open to the public for viewing on Saturdays from 11 to two. If you want to see the inside of the lighthouse, you'll need to register for one of their tours. For more information, including how to register for a tour, visit our website at bestlifeadventurechannel.com. The west end of Atlantic Avenue is called Center Street. It's the heart of downtown Fernandina Beach, and it's a great place to spend an afternoon. There you'll find more than half a mile of fun shops, restaurants, bars, places to stay, and lovingly maintained historical sites. You can enjoy a meal waterside or even get out on a boat for a sunset cruise. We absolutely love downtown Fernandina Beach and highly recommend that you spend some time here when you come to visit. We can't decide though whether we enjoy it more under the beautiful Florida sun-filled skies or at night when it takes on a completely different feel. Tell us what you think in the comments below. All that we've done so far has been in Fernandina Beach, but now we're traveling 20 minutes south to Big Talbot Island. We're on Boneyard Beach on Big Talbot Island in Florida. This place is fantastic if you like to take photos. There's down trees all up and down the beach and uh, we'll take you down the trail. It's about maybe a five minute walk to get down the trail to the beach. And once you get there, it's fantastic.
What do you think of that bike? out here on Little Talbot Island. And when you come in at Little Talbot Island, you can get down to some beach accesses right after you come through the gate. But if you get on the beach and you come north, you can get to some really remote places. I mean, you can see behind us, there is nobody on this beach. We practically have the entire thing to ourselves, And this stretch of sand is at least one mile long. This is a big, wide open stretch of open beach where you can come, have your seclusion, and enjoy some really, really amazing, beautiful Florida beaches. And collect shark's teeth because there are plenty. Yeah, here. lots of shells here, lots of shells. This is a great place. We highly, highly recommend Little Talbot Island. Tell us about our flight. Um, today we're trying the Billy, the Grace, the Canary Cross, and the Verona, which is a chocolate stuff. And I'm excited to try that one. That's good. Yeah? That's a good beer. It's a good everyday beer. All right. A little sweet. You can taste the banana a little bitty bit on the back end and a little bit of orange. I don't really taste the clove so much, but this flavor is, is amazing. That one's good. A plus on that one. The red, Irish red ale. It smells like a red. <laughs> Tastes like that's good. Yeah, I like the first one better, but this is a good beer. I could drink this. All right, it tastes like a red, like a killing. Definitely heavy on the caramel. Yeah, it's not a bad beer. It's not bad. Not yeah. my favorite, but it's heavy on the caramel flavor. <laughs> oh, it smells good. That's a good start. I'm excited for this one. Yeah, that's good. For a stout, that's good. I'm still a pretty big fan of the peanut butter stout, but this one's pretty good. All right, I got the shaved prime rib. Look at that. It's literally falling apart. <laughs> Oh my goodness, that is really good. It's got blue cheese. <clears throat> that is really, really good. I like that. Okay, I'm about to try the Reuben. I'm excited because it looks so yummy. Yeah, very tender. It's good. Let's see. Looks good. Look at that. This video is part one in our series on the legendary A1A Highway, in which we will visit the amazing seaside locations dotted along the trail of this historic Florida roadway. Check back soon for our next installment. If you've not already done so, please subscribe to our Young and Growing channel for more great content. It's free, but it means a great deal to us and we greatly appreciate it. You can also check us out on both Facebook and Instagram, where we share photos, videos, surveys, and discussions about current and upcoming videos. 
If you've not yet seen one of our road trip shorts, check this one out. These are short, upbeat, and fun looks into other amazing locations. If you like this video, please click like and leave us a comment as well. We hope to see you again soon here on the Best Life Adventure Channel.